Hey, my name is Lance. The Slingshot Project is really just a lot of fun. So let's jump right in. The first step is to create two squares like this. Then glue four craft cubes and then glue the other square on top. Then glue four more craft sticks onto each side of this piece. Next, choose one side to be the front of the slingshot and glue a stick upright onto each side. Then from there, glue two more sticks that connect the top of this one to the bottom corner of the base. Next, glue two more vertical sticks onto the front corners of the slingshot. Then connect the vertical sticks with another cube on top. Finish the structure by gluing one more stick that connects the vertical columns. Make sure that the stick is lower than the halfway point. To prepare for the sling, glue two more cubes onto the front of the slingshot. Once the glue has dried completely, stretch out a rubber band between those cubes. Make sure that the rubber band is resting in that gap between the cubes. To make the sling, first cut a piece of cardstock that's about an inch and a half wide and three inches long. Curve that piece of cardstock into a C shape and wedge it between the rubber bands. Then use several layers of tape to attach that cardstock sling to the rubber bands. Okay, we're ready to fire. Put one hand under the back of the base and then grasp the front of the base. Then use your other hand to load your projectile. I like using these foam cubes. Then pinch the top and bottom of the sling, pull back as much as you want and let go. Okay, and that's how you build the basic design. Okay, that's all for this project. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.